Tonight on The Price of Freedom, we have the story of a World War II era veteran who spent more than three years in the Army. And that part of the story is interesting, but what may be more interesting is what he did for 64 years after his military service. Don Henderson grew up in Alabama and was drafted in 1945. I was a high school dropout. Went, to, uh, I finished the 10th grade. Went down to Brunswick, Georgia. Well, I went to Chattanooga to a welding school. Then from there I went to Brunswick at a shipyard. Worked there until I was drafted in the Army in World War II. He trained all over the country, from Florida to Louisiana to Oregon, then Washington. Then the Army put him on a ship and sent him to Japan. It ended when I was on my way over there. And that was, I guess, lucky for me. Mr. Henderson was among the first occupation forces in Japan. He spent about three and a half years in the Army. He got out, and I was working. I had three different jobs in Chattanooga. Wasn't satisfied with anything. I just, I just couldn't find what I wanted to do. He moved to Arizona and worked at a copper mine, then to Seattle to work for Boeing. One of us would bring a paper in, and we would divide up during lunch hour, you know. Now I wound up with the one ads, and I saw uh, an ad there. It said, Greyhound has taken an application for drivers. Man, I clocked out right then, went down and turned my application in. After I started driving the bus, I thought, this is what I want. Don Henderson has spent most of his life since then behind the wheel of something. Tell us what you were doing right before we showed up. I was more than the grass. <laughs> about, uh, about two acres of it. He's 92 years old now. He drove Greyhound buses for 33 years. Then he drove trucks. Down on 23rd Street, uh, back in Volvo. And uh, I went down there and I started doing that. Did that for 28 years. He drove for a living for 64 years total. That's what I liked. I just love going across the country, seeing the country. I've been in, I guess I've been in all lower 48 states that I would never seen if I hadn't been driving. He retired for good a couple of years ago when he was 90 years old. Yeah, I, I, I just miss it. But I guess it comes a time you, you got to give it up. So enjoy it while you can. <laughs> Mr. Henderson basically had two careers driving, drove buses 33 years, trucks for 28 years, and drove several years in between that. Josh, thank you. And for more Price of Freedom stories, head to our website, which is newschannel9.com. And join us for a special discussion.